The Bucks confirmed Monday their practice facility is shut down after coronavirus testing Friday. The Bucks won't say who tested positive for COVID-19. We have had two positive COVID tests prior to intake. Brewers manager Craig Council revealed Monday two Brewers players tested positive for COVID-19 before they reported to Miller Park last week. Angel Perdomo and Luis Urias have, have were positive earlier um, prior to the intake process, so they are um, in COVID protocols at this point. Bucks fan Josh Thomas wonders if the positive tests will allow pro sports to resume. Are we going to see anything with as soon as they're back, then all of a sudden there's COVID cases? It sucks that the second big wave is coming through. I mean, I don't really know what to expect. I know that they're trying to play down in Orlando uh, the last couple games of the season, and then I don't know what's going to happen with the playoffs. Sports radio is buzzing about the impact to all sports. Two months from now, the NFL season starting, first games, I, we will know. I mean, this is all going to go down here in the next two or three weeks. Whether we're going to have football, we're going to have high school football, we're going to have any of this. Council said they all need reminders about social distancing. Learning as we go, um, trying to get into um, the, a, a normalcy with it of, of how to spread out and uh, the best way to do it. And we're getting better at it, but we can, get, we can, we can improve every day still. Now, Terry, what about the Bucks? What did they say about how the positive COVID test could impact their season? Patrick, the Bucks aren't commenting, but the team is scheduled to leave for Orlando late, later this week to Orlando to continue their practice and scrimmage schedule with the last official game and the restart the last day of this month.